Hey guys, on days like today, wind's blowing 20 some mile an hour probably. Low visibility, you can see the trees blowing from the wind. Now if you'll notice, if I look over on this edge, the trees are blowing more violently on that side. So you wanna find something on this side. Now I'm looking at possibility if I got disoriented and figured I'm going to have to spend the night right here, uh, there's low cell service up here, uh, partly because the government has included this in an area where they have uh, cut down on communication. That's pretty good of them, so it makes it harder to get out. Used to be better cell service up here. And I've called... Uh, local phone services here and they said they don't have any towers down or anything like this but if I had spent the night I'm looking right now uh, here's a big down timber uh, or you can get up against there but the wind's blowing in that direction get against one of these big logs but you may have noticed what I see right here this is on top of the ridge, but the way it's facing, it's blocking most of the wind. I can feel the wind pick up up to 20 mile an hour, just coming up to the top of this ridge. So I'd probably be better off to look for something down here, maybe on the back side of that route. Um, or I could get up here against this rock cliff, lay some timbers up against that uh, and get some branches to keep the wind and maybe a little bit of the rain off but if I keep looking there's probably a spot over here where I could not only be blocked by the wind but get up underneath it you know, you've got an outcrop to come here as long as you just don't find the same den that either a coyote or a West Virginia black bear got into. And then you better be looking about building a fire. Now, as you notice, it's been raining here through the evening. So most everything's wet. You're gonna have a hard time starting a fire. But where you are searching for shelter, you're probably also gonna find a little bit of dry leaves, some dry small branches dead green briar or something like that to help you build uh, to get it started. And though this is wet out here, you can always find dead timber that's already dried out even though it's raining. Most of the inside of it is going to be dry. And you don't want to get what's laying on the ground. You want to get that dead timber that is still standing. And there's plenty of that around here. So I'm going to let you notice I'm going to look over the uh, mountain ridge right here and let you notice the difference in the wind, say from right here to where I'm going to look right here. You see where these green briars are growing thick. Ooh, big difference. <laughs> 